Channel 12, Arizona's leading news station. This is Action News. Good evening, I'm Mike Hambrick. And I'm Linda Alvarez. In the news tonight... Channel 12, Arizona's leading news station. This is Action News. Good afternoon. I'm Vince Leonard. I'm Kathy Kirchner. This is Action News. Good afternoon with Jerry Foster. I'm Vince Leonard. From Channel 12, Arizona's leading news station, this is Action News. Good evening, I'm Kathy Kirchner, sitting in for Linda Alvarez. And I'm Kent Dana. The second... Good morning. This is Action News Digest. Good morning. <laughs> From Arizona's leading news station. This is Action News at Noon. Good afternoon. I'm Vince Leonard with Jerry Foster. Here's what's happening. This is Action News tonight with Linda Alvarez and Kent Dana. Coming. This is Action News tonight with Kent Dana and Patty Kirkpatrick. And coming up, our future... Live report is next. This is Channel 12 News. With Kent Dana, Patty Kirkpatrick, Bill Austin's weather, and Bill Denny with sports. Near 25th Street and Broadway, another drug bust at Keys Market, perhaps the single busiest drug dealing spot in the entire city. What are the chances for American hostages still held captive in Lebanon? Can a secret deal that's no longer a secret be salvaged? Some answers now on Channel 12 News Tonight. Good evening. This is Channel 12 News Tonight. With Kent Dana, Patty Kirkpatrick, Bill Austin's weather, and Bill Denny with sports. Also tonight, a Channel 12 News Extra. Rick DeBrule reports the Arizona driving test. Good evening. Tonight, the one secret White House operation to bring the Beirut hostages home. She is closed captioned for the hearing impaired. Good evening. 
This is Channel 12 News Tonight with Kent Dana, Patty Kirkpatrick, Bill Austin's Weather, and Bill Denny with Sports. Good evening. The committee considering impeachment of the governor heard more potentially damaging testimony tonight. Now, Vince Leonard, Lynn Sue Shepard, Bill Austin's Weather, and Steve Pacetti on Sports. This is 12 News, 5 o'clock. 12 News Scribe. Closed captioning for the hearing impaired is brought to you by Driver, Yoder, and Reeves Court Reporters. Now, Kent Dana, Patty Kirkpatrick, Bill Austin's Forecast, and Bill Denny Sports. This is 12 News Tonight. One year ago, the Dude Fire wiped out 24,000 acres of Arizona forest. Tonight, forest rangers are worried that an arsonist could kick off another round of devastation. Live from KPNX Channel 12, your choice for real life, real news in the 90s. Kent Dana. Janine Ford, Bill Austin Weather, and Bill Denny Sports. 12 News Tonight. Arrests in a string of Valley murders, including a pizza delivery driver and a mother of three. The body of a missing nurse is found in the desert, and a teenager is facing murder charges. The presidential race is heading into the home stretch. And this is a record setting ride for a roller coaster lover. Good evening, I'm Rick DeBrule. And I'm Marianne McClary. Here's the latest tonight at 10. The investigation into that North Phoenix nurse... 12 News is closed caption for the hearing in there. Now, from the Grand Canyon to the White Mountains and Sonoran Desert, the team that brings you news from across our state with Ron Hoon and Connie Cola. Closed captioning for the hearing impaired is brought to you by Bank One, whatever it takes. Now, from the Grand Canyon to the White Mountains and Sonoran Desert, the team that brings you news from across our state with Lindsay Shepard, Bruce Kirk, Bill Austin Weather, and Steve Pesceni Sports. Good evening. Welcome to 12 News 5 o'clock, everybody. I'm Bruce Kirk. And I'm Janine Ford in for Lynn Sue Shepard. First tonight's top. You're watching 12 News at 6. Arizona Did you just get out of all this rush hour traffic? You're looking at a live picture from Sky 12 over I-10 and 40th Street. Once again, it's a traffic nightmare. But tonight, there is a controversial solution to the traffic crunch. Good evening. Thanks for joining us for 12 News at 6. 12 News closed captioning for the hearing impaired is brought to you by Bank One, whatever it takes. Now, from the Grand Canyon to the White Mountains and Sonoran Desert, the team that brings you news from across our state. With Kent Dana, Lynn Sue Shepard, Seen McLaughlin Weather, and Bill Denny Sports. Twelve News closed captioning for the hearing impaired is brought to you by Bank One, whatever it takes. From the Grand Canyon to the White Mountains and Sonoran Desert, a team that brings you news from across our state. With Kent Dana, Janine Ford, Bill Austin Weather, and Bill Denny Sports. And Dana, Janine Ford, Bean McLaughlin, and Mark Curtis. They all want to lead the nation. From Arizona's most watched station, this is 12 News. This is 12 News today for Tuesday, December 1st. Good morning, everybody. I'm Jill Miles. Thanks for joining us. From Arizona's most watched station, this is 12 News. Tough talk turned into massive military... This is from the drive through From Arizona's most watched station, this is 12 News. A Valley hospital is the one fighting for its life tonight. 
from Arizona's most watched station, this is 12 News. Good evening. Drivers in East Phoenix didn't believe their eyes early this evening. They saw stands for local news. And now, from Arizona's most watched station, this is 12 News Saturday morning. 12 stands for local news. And now, from Arizona's most watched station, this is 12 News at 11. With Election Day less than two weeks away... A stands for local news and now from Arizona's most watched station this is 12 news at 6 I'll do it 6 12 stands for local news from Arizona's most watched station 12 news at 5 starts now a tragic father's day for 12 stands for local news and now from Arizona's number one choice for local news this is 12 news at 5 Hi, everybody. Sue McLaughlin live over in Glendale. Happy Friday to... 12 stands for local news. And now, from Arizona's number one choice for local news, this is 12 News at 6. New at 6, checking your checking account. I was being charged $48.79. The leader in HD. This is 12 News Today. City of Phoenix is randomly... Leader in HD. This is 12 News at 10. Good evening, everyone. I'm Mark Curtis. And I'm Lynn Cooney. This is 12 News at 10 in high def. We begin with two breaking news stories tonight. You're watching Arizona's most trusted news team with Lynn Cooney, Mark Curtis, Faye Fredericks, Bill Kelly, and Kevin Hunt. This is 12 News in High Definition. Welcome back to 12 News at 10. A prominent Valley minister about to play a big role in the quote, restoration. Of the leader in HD. This is 12 News Today. The most highly anticipated. The leader in HD. This is 12 News Evening Edition. It's called 12. The leader in HD. This is 12 News Evening Edition. Good evening. The bulls take over as stocks soar. Google investors have reason to celebrate. While there is some surprising news, from one of the big airlines flying out of Sky Harbor. Like the markets, the hard times and money meltdown has its share of highs and lows. The leader in HD. This is 12 News at 10. New this morning, police are looking for the person who pulled the trigger in a Phoenix shooting just a short time ago. President Obama cuts his overseas trip short. He is headed to Dallas, where police say the gunman in that deadly ambush had much bigger plans. No rain in sight, but it does look like the temperatures are on the rise. More on that coming up. The game that has taken the world by storm. We're talking about Pokemon Go. On the Valley Zone, Michaela Skinner heading to Rio. Just not the way she had hoped for. We'll have more on that in just a little bit. It's a bit bittersweet. It's very bittersweet. Connecting Arizona. This is 12 News. Good afternoon and thanks for watching 12 News at Noon. I'm Crystal Henderson. Connecting Arizona. This is 12 News at 10. Cops who use deadly force protected from the public by keeping their names a secret is making some Arizonans mad. 12 News at 10 tracking a developing story right now. A teenager in critical condition and a 15-year-old is dead after a horrific crash in North Phoenix. Police say it appears so far the teens were speeding and then they hit a woman driving an SUV. Gia Vang spoke to a relative of that woman along with friends who know the teenager who did not survive. She joins us live from you. Here we go. 12 News at 10 starts right now. Good evening. The magic of the bird's nest. The Cards grab their first win of the preseason, beating the Raiders 20 to 10. History. 12 News at 5 starts right now. 
A 21-year-old Valley mom is missing, and her tiny baby girl is found abandoned by the side of the road. The search is on tonight to find... Good evening, everyone. Our big story tonight, it was the chase we just couldn't turn away from. And now we're learning more about the three suspects arrested. Police say they're part of a dangerous robbery and burglary crew. Plus, we saw one of the suspects, Arizona's news leader, in action for you tonight. Here we go. 12 News at 10 starts right now. I'm fearful for my life, my children's life. She returns to our apartment complex. The big story on 12 News at 10, an ex-boyfriend accused of taking stalking to the extreme, antagonizing his ex-girlfriend for years. Investigators say he moved into the same complex as her and her new boyfriend and then set that man's car on fire.